Okay everybody, it is smoothie time. This is one of the easiest ways to start incorporating more raw into your current lifestyle. I'm gonna show you two smoothies today. One is one that I call the starter smoothie. Why do I call it this? Well, a lot of people have problems drinking green in the morning. So I'm gonna show you how you can get green into your morning drink and still make it taste oh so good. Kids, husbands, they both love this. The second smoothie I'm going to show you though is the gum green smoothie and this is what I have every single morning for the past three years chocked full of goodness. Look at it all. Green, 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 green. This is what I call the starter smoothie. You've got two bananas, two oranges, two cups blueberry, two cups spinach, and then we have our liquid, either regular water, coconut water, or even nut milk. And if you haven't watched the nut milk webisode so you can learn how to make this, you should do that next. So I always like to start my smoothies out with a nice mm, liquid. Usually I use regular water, but I am in love with coconut water. It has so many nutrients in it. It has all your amino acids, all your essentials that you need. Next we're going to add two bananas. It's a little trick for you. I always opened it from here and then I learned it's so easy to open it from the other end. This is how the monkeys and the gorillas do it. It's so much easier. Pop that out. Next up, two oranges. Let's see, I like to piece them up just a little bit. This way we get a lot of vitamin C in the morning. And it's really important to have fruit in the morning and have fruit usually by itself but there's an exception when it comes to food combining. It's also really good with leafy greens. So I've got two cups of spinach right here. And I'm gonna set that in next. And then lastly, blueberries. You can use fresh blueberries if you want to. For me personally though, I like my smoothies in the morning to be cold, so it just makes more sense to have one of your ingredients cold. In fact, I'm actually going to add some ice to this as well. Alright, breakfast in a blender. Coconut water, bananas, oranges, spinach, blueberries, ice. Now if you want to, you can add any type of green powder, you can add your flaxseed, you can add maca. I add it all in the morning because the morning starts your day, right? And you want to start your day off right, especially when you're a raw foodist. So a lot of people ask me, how long do I blend my smoothies? Well, as long as you want. I really just watch the sides and I watch to make sure everything's incorporated and looks good, smells good. It's time for breakfast. Now look at that. That looks appetizing, right? Bottoms up. Mm. Perfect. Let's get on to the gums green smoothie. So we're going to use the Vitamix, the blender again. Again, you can use a normal blender. It's just that I like to use the Vitamix. It's much more powerful. And the first thing I'm going to start off with is, mm, we're going to start off with a little nut milk. This is going to add creaminess to my green drink. So about a cup of nut milk and then I add about a cup of water. Then I take one cucumber slice it up and all I'm doing by cutting this up is just making it easier for the blender. The next thing is celery. I usually take one stalk of celery. I chop the end off because it's just not so pretty. I usually chop it into two inch pieces. This is so those fibers don't get wrapped around the blade and cause me trouble. So next up my herbs. So I start with mint, then some parsley, and I literally just take a handful of parsley, a little cilantro, and a little bit of kale, which is my favorite, favorite vegetable in the whole wide world. Then I'm going to top it all off 
with another creamy fruit. This adds just enough sweetness. A banana. I'm gonna add a little green powder. This is raw and has all my spirulina and chlorella and all the good junk. A little maca powder. It's a powder from Peru and it really helps balance hormones. So add a little bit of that. It's also really, really, really good for the sex drive. And who couldn't use some of that? And then last, a little flax. And that's it. I just love that color. Look how beautiful that is. I mean, come on. Yum! No joke, I have this every single morning and it pretty much lasts me till noon. Mm. It's that easy, you guys. Just start.